Welcome Scorpio, Someone Rising and Venus. Today I'll be doing your general reading for August 2021. So first I will be asking for three Romance Angel Oracle cards. Let's see what messages they have for you. What do you have for Scorpio please, August 2021? God, Angels, Holy Spirit. What do you have for Scorpio, August 2021? One more. Okay, Scorpio. You deserve love. You are lovable, okay? Let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally and free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Okay. So, Scorpio, if you've been feeling like, uh, like love, like do I even deserve it? Do I need it? Do I want it? Yes, okay? Everybody deserves love, okay? And... Just let go of control issues, okay? Allow things to unfold naturally. Maybe you or the person that you're the person that you're connecting with has been maybe trying to control everything or trying to control the situation, the outcome, stuff like that. Just let things flow naturally here. And then maybe for some of you it might be time to free yourself, okay? Time time to take back control, especially if you've been giving a lot in a situation. But let's take a further look here using the tarot. All right. God, angels, Holy Spirit. What happened in the recent past for the sign of Scorpio? What happened in the recent past? Recent past, Scorpio, High Priestess, Eight of Swords in Reverse, and the Queen of Swords. Could have been dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay, or a Pisces here. What was your intuition telling you, Scorpio? that you were not listening to, okay? This could definitely be the person that you're dealing with. It doesn't have to be you. The rules can be reversed. And again, it's not going to raise any with all of you. Feel free to check your other placements. But for some of you Scorpios, what is it that your intuition was telling you, but maybe you were deciding not to listen to it, okay? Something here, it's kind of like, you know, was keeping you stuck. I feel like, okay, a lot of you were either, one, avoiding feeling stuck, like, okay, no, I'm just not going to think about it. I'm going to ignore it. Uh... You know, maybe, yeah, I feel stuck. I feel like, uh, you know, I don't know what to do here, but I'm just going to, whatever, right? And for others of you, you were actually getting out of the stuck energy, okay? Because you finally gained the clarity and you finally received the answers that you um, needed here. This could also be a head over heart decision here or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius communicated something to you. Let's take a further look here, okay? Please clarify the recent past. Could also and guys keep in mind this could be about a work situation a love situation family friends take it how it resonates here okay clarify recent past here for scorpio okay yeah you could have been dealing with a soulmate okay all right scorpio you have a lot of love for someone you do you do you have a lot of love for someone, unless you're dealing with another water sign or somebody has strong water in their chart, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, but you have the Four of Swords in reverse, the Six of Pentacles in reverse, and the Queen of Cups upright. Restless energy, okay, not taking the time to um, to rest, to think, to, to gain clarity. Again, Scorpio, I'm really feeling the energy that maybe in the past you or someone around your energy was not taking the time to rest, not taking the time to possibly heal, not taking the time to gain that clarity here there might have been a, a lack of equal give and take as well here with the six of pentacles but i see love here i do see love here with the queen of cups a lot of you may also have recently lost a lot of finances or spent over a lot of money okay yeah some of you you're definitely dealing with either a gemini Libra, aquarius another water sign of capricorn Virgo, taurus i'm getting strong air energy here strong air clarify here one more card recent past sign of scorpio yeah the seven of swords in reverse um stagnant energy you may have been dealing with somebody at a distance with the three of wands Okay, could have been someone at a distance who maybe couldn't make a decision or somebody here was taking a long time to make a decision. Seven of Swords in reverse, more more air energy. I feel that either someone was trying to get away with something or whatever that was hidden has finally been exposed here. Okay. 
it's like someone was trying to like either ignore something or get away with something, but it got exposed. Again, could be in love, could be in career, finances, money, or I mean, family, friends, yeah. Let's go ahead and take a look at your current energy, Scorpio. Current energies for the sign of Scorpio. What's going on right now with Scorpio, August 2021? God, angels, Holy Spirit, please be clear. Yeah, okay. So, Ten of Wands, Ace of Wands, and the Four of Pentacles. Okay, strong Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus energy. So, I'm, I'm feeling that right now you feel very burdened. Okay, Scorpio, you feel tired, you feel exhausted. Again, maybe because you were not resting enough or taking a time out here in the recent past with the Four of Swords in reverse. You're feeling drained, okay? Get some rest. Um, you know, something here is maybe over, like, burdening you or making you feel stressed, exhausted. It's, you know, just, oh, it's too much. It's too much, okay? But I do see that for a lot of you, there's a new beginning coming your way. If it hasn't already happened, there's a new beginning, possibly a new love. Something new is being created here, okay, with the Ace of Wands. A lot of passion as well, okay? Um, I'm going to go ahead and clarify, but I am feeling the energy where maybe this was a very um, sexual-based type of connection, okay? Maybe the, the attraction was very strong here. Um, but again, I'm going to clarify. Four of Pentacles, it's like you're holding on to your money. You're holding on to maybe certain things maybe people are asking you scorpio what's wrong scorpio what's going on and you're deciding to keep that to yourself at this time because you don't maybe you don't want to reveal something yet or you don't want to expose something yet again this could be about finances maybe just you're starting to save again because maybe you did have losses of money here it's like you're holding on to either secrets or something that just has been exposed or you're keeping your finances to yourself so take whichever resonates here holding on to your money okay some of you may also be saving for something let's clarify what's this ten of wands about here current energies for the sign of scorpio five of cups something that maybe you've tried way too many times and it's just you're losing hope in the situation you're losing hope but there is two cups standing here so there is a possibility here Scorpio to possibly fix something or make something work but again it's up to you right free will but I do see that you're losing hope or you're just yeah you're losing hope in something or someone here why is the ace of wands here current energy is for the sign of Scorpio this could also be vice versa guys it doesn't, you know if this is not your energy it could be someone around you here ace of wands why is the ace of wands here current energy is for the sign of Scorpio the emperor okay I'm hearing Libra I'm hearing Aries hearing um yeah okay with the emperor here okay maybe you're dealing with someone who um some of you may be meeting someone who's very powerful you may be meeting someone you may have a new beginning and uh with someone at your job I mean, you might meet someone through your work okay for those of you who are completely single i do see new love coming here a new beginning a new a new idea okay this is someone very powerful this is someone who's been through a lot okay why is the emperor here with the ace of wands yeah two of cups definitely love related yeah i see a lot of you pisces cancer scorpio here aries leo sagittarius maybe a libra okay aries but new new beginning this could be a new person coming your way so if you are single or if you've been wanting to have new love a new beginning i do see love coming your way two of cups is beautiful energy it is soulmate energy okay so not only is there going to be a lot of passion here but there's also going to be a lot of genuine love Why is the Four of Pentacles here? Current energies, please. Sign of Scorpio. The lovers in reverse. Okay. So Gemini. Okay, Gemini energy here. You might have been dealing... Okay, you might be holding on either to a... Could be any sign. Okay, but could be a Gemini. Could be an Aries, a Libra. I'm hearing... Yeah, basically, but it could be any sign. Gemini for some of you. Yeah, I keep saying Gemini, sorry. But anyways, you might be holding on to a like this person, okay? But for others of you, it's kind of like maybe you don't want to tell people this information that you found out about this person, okay? Again, could be love, could be a family member, a friend, something like that. 
Maybe you're holding to some, you're holding some secrets about what happened with this person or this connection. You don't want people to know something here. Again, this could be this person, right? For very few of you, 10% of you, this could be something to do with cheating, okay? Maybe someone doesn't want to say that, like, doesn't want the whole infidelity to be exposed, I'm hearing. Ten of Wands, again, this is something that's stressing you out, Scorpio, what's going on here? Yes, this is someone that, or something that's stressing you out. What is this? Is it finances or is it this person? Or is it the secret or whatever happened between you guys that's straining the crap out of you? What is it? Okay. If this is not your energy, this is somebody that, that you were dealing with or a situation that you were dealing with that's that's draining someone. Okay, Aries Leo Sagittarius energy. Interesting. I'm also hearing that some of you may be in love with a coworker, a boss, someone who's very powerful, someone who maybe someone who's older as well. There might be an age difference. Eight to ten years. Four to ten years. Maybe even 14 years. What do you have for the near future for the sign of Scorpio? Near future for the sign of Scorpio. Okay. I see you getting over a heartbreak, especially if it was from a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay. But I feel like something quick is coming in here. Something quick, uh, quick communication, quick, new, quick news, quick something here is coming in very quick. I'm going to go ahead and clarify that. But I do see you gaining the strength to move forward here. Okay, there might be a Leo that you might be, that might be significant in the future or that you might be meeting. But I feel like you're, you're, you're trying to get over a heartbreak here in the near future. Okay, or trying not to, um, it's like you're finally getting the strength maybe to get out there again, I'm hearing. Let's clarify. Why is a Knight of Swords here in your future for the sign of Scorpio? Seven of Cups in reverse. You see things for how they are in the near future. You're finally going to be like, you know what? This is how it is. For some of you, this person is going to come back. Uh, Gemini Libra Aquarius wanting to pick you. Maybe this person had options. They're going to say, I want to be with you. Or maybe they've told you this already. I don't know. Be careful with your finances. I keep hearing that, Scorpio. Okay sure you're not yeah just be careful with your finances why is the three of swords in reverse here in your future page yeah you might be getting over uh, also somebody maybe with aries leo sagittarius or uh capricorn i mean not capricorn um gemini libra aquarius gemini libra aquarius aries leo sagittarius you might be getting over a heartbreak that this person caused could have been someone at a distance someone who possibly maybe is a student or someone who is learning something new here, someone who's very maybe spontaneous, adventurous, um, but they're in reverse. So I feel like maybe you saw this person's true colors. I see you getting over that. Why is the strength card here in your future for the sign of Scorpio? Yeah, again, Queen of Wands in reverse. Uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, some of you are definitely dealing with somebody in the, with fire in their chart. I see you getting over this. I see you having the strength to let this. I feel like this person disappointed you. I feel like this person. Um, you know, they were not as, I, I don't want to say loyal, but could be, right? Maybe the love, the love was a little bit unrequited as well. One more. Yeah, see? Okay, seven of pentacles in reverse. Someone who was not putting, seven might be very significant. Something could happen seven days ago. It could have happened in July. Okay, July could have been something like, boom, like that was a breaking point or something like around those lines. So either seven days, seven weeks, seven months, or July, or seven years, okay? But with the Queen of Wands here, you're getting over this. You're getting the strength to, I feel like, to, to not, uh, yeah, I feel like this person wasn't putting in as much work as you, okay, Scorpio? Yeah, the Chariot, very slow-moving energy. Um, the Death card, Scorpio, this is you putting an end to something, maybe deciding not to have a new beginning here, okay? Yeah, Knight of Wands again, a strong, strong air, strong fire here, okay? Yeah, the world card could have been someone at a distance, yep. Someone who wasn't willing to maybe move in, 
have a higher level of commitment, not wanting to travel towards you, not wanting to make a decision. You're getting out of this. Wow, your message is very clear today. Somebody who was a trickster, yeah. Okay, I'm done right there with this, but you're getting over that. But I do see this person coming back, trying to tell you, Scorpio, I pick you, Scorpio, let's do it. But you're gonna be like, well, you know, do you mean that? And look what's under the deck, justice card. Libra energy, some of you may be with the Libra, okay? Things will be balanced. Wow. Again, if it's not resonating, feel free to check your other placements, okay, guys? Let's see, what else or who else is coming towards Scorpio here? Who or what else is coming towards Scorpio? August 2021. Who or what else is coming towards Scorpio? August 2021. Angels, Holy Spirit. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, shit's gonna shit's gonna be exposed. You know, somebody tried to get away with something, didn't work out here with the five of swords. Two of swords, a decision will be made. No longer feeling stuck, okay? Gemini Libra Aquarius energy and the Knight of Cups. Some of you have another water sign coming towards you, offering you love, okay? And the death card, Scorpio energy. This is you putting an end, having a new beginning. I feel like a lot of you, you know, you're just you're deciding to put an end to something, okay? Because you see clear now, you have clarity now, okay? Something that possibly didn't work out, Aquarius energy, judgment card, maybe there was a conversation, a confrontation made to, yeah, this is just super clear, okay? You could have saw marriage with this person, but you're like, you know what, this person, like, maybe they didn't know what they wanted, or, um, yeah, but I do see possibly another water sign coming your way, okay? If you're single. Maybe even a Leo, okay, or uh, yeah. strong water, maybe. Yeah, I see strong water. Pay attention to a water sign, okay? What advice do you have for these signs of Scorpio? Ooh, okay. The only thing that is real is love. Shift your focus from the problem back to love. This is your advice, Scorpio. Take it how it resonates, okay? Shift the problem back to love. All right. What crystal do you have for the sign of Scorpio? If you don't have this crystal, it's okay. Feel free to write it down, screenshot it, Google it to see how it can help you this month. What crystal do you have for the sign of Scorpio? Moonstone. Okay. Moon cycles and crown chakra. So feel free to... Uh, beautiful crystal, by the way. It's like bluish, purplish. Really beautiful crystal. Um, look, look this up, guys. Okay, see how it can help you this month. How it can help you manifest and stuff like that. And it's interesting because I just, I, I start to have a headache right now. So I don't know if some of you have been overthinking about a situation, but you know, maybe your crown chakra is, is blocked or something. I don't know, but I feel like, look this crystal up, okay? All right, what angel number do you have for, um, some of you also may need to drink more water, okay, I'm hearing. Yeah. What's a uh, Chris? I mean, what, uh, sorry guys. What angel number do you have for the sign of Scorpio, that angel's Holy spirit? What angel number? Pay attention to this number, okay? 111, beautiful. I am creative. Angels are ready to fully support you in this endeavor so that you can co-create with the universe a life you love. Beautiful. All right, my lovely Scorpios. Well, um, thank you for watching. Again, it's not going to resonate with all of you. Feel free to check your other placements. If you haven't already, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.